Welcome back to Prep Recruiting Insider. This is PRI here at NOLA Motorsports Park in Avondale. I'm your host, Rick Gailey, along with Renee Nato, the insider in Prep Recruiting Insider. And we're joined by two terrific Rummel athletes, two great Archbishop Rummel Raiders. To your right, cornerback Christian Fulton, and to your left, Chase Forcade. Welcome, gentlemen, to Prep Recruiting Insider. Nice to be here. Thank you. Chase, start with you first. Uh, 23 and 5 as a starter. Um, and you've decided you want to go to Nickel State. Yes, sir. Uh, first of all, why the Colonels? Why was that a good uh, fit? You know, uh, new coaching staff. And, you know, we had our coach from last year, Coach Lee. He, he uh, the offensive line coach over there now. And, uh, you know, I know they're building a program over there. And I have a lot of Roman people that, that go there now, like Ryan Hanley, Damian John Pierre. They all start now, and you know they, they said that it's like a family over there with Coach Rebo, and also with Coach Lee, and just all the players surrounding them. Now, Christian, you made All State last year. You had 11 letter interceptions. Uh, really had some great performances. You're still kind of in the process of looking. Mm -hmm. uh, you're gonna wait till the season's over. What are some of the schools that you maybe uh, are taking a close look at? Well, I'm taking a, 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 a close look at a lot of schools. You know, some I have trimmed down, but I'm still looking at um, Florida, LSU, Texas A&M. Texas, Miami, Arkansas, and Ole Miss, you know, some of those are some of the schools that I'm looking at hard, and they're looking at me hard still. And I know Rick has some questions. When are you going to make a decision? Is it going to be a signing day decision, or are you just going to, uh, when you see something you like, are you going to pull the trigger? Uh, right now <laughs> is when I see something I like, you know. I'm, I haven't been thinking about it lately, you know, when the season started, mm -hmm. you know, so I, I plan to wait till after the season, you know, focus just on the season, you know, and winning the district championship and then state championship. And Chase, you also are a catcher on the baseball team. Rummel, yes, known for their outstanding baseball for years and years and years. Uh, last week, in playing the Shaw Eagles for the megaphone, their quarterback is also the catcher on their baseball team, Matt Keller, another yes, outstanding sir. player. Uh, talk about that relationship, uh, competing with him, a very good player in two sports, but also competing last week for the megaphone. Yes, sir. Uh, you know, me and Matt, we go way back because my 10 year old year, we played travel ball against each other and we were both rival teams. And we just built that relationship from being 10 to being 17 now. And uh, just him behind the plate. And when I'm up the bat, we always talk and just talk about football and baseball. And, and then before the game uh, this past Saturday, we talked a little bit and just, just enjoying each other and just enjoying the game, football and baseball. And Christian, uh, with Coach Jack Allard's defense, you get to play a lot of different coverages. You've really got to be an intelligent player because you might be uh, cover one, one play, and then it's cover three, and then it's cover two, a variety. Uh, talk about the challenge mentally uh, to be able to play multiple coverages in the, in the Raiders scheme. Well, well, the game of football is all mental, mostly mental, more than it is physical. So, I mean, he tries to keep us on our toes. He tries to make it easy for us, you know, with giving us different coverages and, you know, mixing it up a little bit every now and then, you know. So, I mean, I mean, I give all the credit to the coaches, you know. They make it as simple as possible for us, you know. But, I mean, they just make it as easy as they can. Uh, Chase, you, you, both you guys take your books pretty seriously. You're a 3.6 guy, great point average. Uh, that, that's very important. And, and first of all, what are you going to major in in school? And uh, school and, and, uh, and acad athletics going hand in hand a little bit for you. Yes, sir. Uh, I'll, during college, I would like to be in the ed education part, like a teacher or in a business standpoint. Uh, but I kind of want to surround myself with sports or sports communication like y'all do, like being a reporter or just, you know, just, uh, just being a, just in the sports, sports in general. But Christian, you're another guy. You take your, your academics very, very serious. Why is that so important? And, and what are you going to major in in college? Well, I think academics is important because it's the key to success in life. So, you know, I want to be successful. That's why you, like, work hard and everything. You work hard in a, in a classroom, and it follows to the, to the field. And, uh, I mean, sports, sports management is something I've been looking at. You know, I haven't really decided yet. You know, like Chase said, I want to stay around sports after, after college or if I do go to the next level. And Christian, we're going to go to you first. Uh, while you do participate in a variety of coverages, uh, what do you like to do the best? Uh, you, and, and you don't just stay stuck on one side. It's one week you're on one side, and next week you're playing both sides. Uh, tell me what you like to do the best. 
Uh, to be honest, I like the I like the sack the quarterback because uh, you know that, that's a new position for me this year. Coach Jack Lar and the defense staff they found another position for me. You know to play the nickel back. So I like I like to blitz a lot. You know I begged them a lot last year to do it, but I didn't get a chance to. But I think that's real fun to do. Never seen a defensive back that didn't like to eventually sack the quarterback. And that, then speaking of a quarterback, Chase, uh, I know Coach Roth real well as you know. Uh, but what 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 play do you like the best? And don't tell me 26, 27 power. All right. Uh, what what play do you really enjoy uh, executing in the Raider attack? Uh, I like the vertical package we have. Uh, you know, it's it's a lot of reads going through my mind, just mentally, and just making the right read and just doing executing the play. And uh, yeah, also, right, I like running the ball too. With the uh, with the offense we have, you know, if coach calls it, you just got to execute. And just so when he called that play, you just got to run it and just do my job. And just I like throwing the ball also. Good. Of course you do. That's why yeah. you're a quarterback. Uh, that's two terrific Rummel athletes, Christian Fulton and Chase Forcade. Thank you for being with us today, uh, gentlemen. And you were talking about the vertical package. I think that's a big uh, progress that you've made this year in your game that the inside seams have become a real threat for the Raiders. We'll be right back with a legend after this timeout from NOLA Motorsports Park in Avondale, PRI.